Hello, everyone. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. It's officially winning time in the NFL. In today's wild card matchup, Victor is the only option for these two teams. So let's go now to Miami, Florida, where Jim and Phil are on the call. There's plenty of electricity in the air here today as we welcome you to a wild card matchup here on EA Sports. Hello, friends, and welcome to Wild Card Weekend around the National Football League. We've got a pair of divisional winners and a pair of wild card teams, and it's postseason time, the most exciting time of the year, Phil. Yeah, we think the regular season is pretty exciting. We say it every year, but then it comes playoff time. We go, wow, this is even more exciting for these football teams today. Don't try to be too creative. Don't reinvent yourself. Do what got you here to the playoffs. And, of course, the team that can do that without turning it over is going to be the team that's going to win this game today. The Dolphins are ready to run back this kick. The Patriots setting up here for the kickoff. This quarterback at this point, this is not a first time experience for him. He's been in a lot of big spots as he takes the field for the first time today. Yeah, veteran quarterbacks, Jim, you're right. It's not their first time seeing a game, situations. They're ready for everything, and their thoughts are always good. First down here. Nickel formation for the defense here. Gets the handle here. And picked up about four. And the offense here in this one will be looking to put points on the board in bunches. And it's now second down and five after running it on first down. The Patriots defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. With two hands, he has it. He's brought down. What's the old expression? Just move the chains. That's what they did with that throw and catch that time, Jim. It also gives them a chance for three more downs. Here we are in the playoffs. And how much of a difference is it between a regular season game and the postseason when it comes to preparation? I think there's a big difference when you talk about regular season against postseason. Players have a tendency to be more emotional, more, I guess you would say, excited, and it's up to the coaches to make sure to give them plays that they can execute and not make Three. costly turnovers Three. early in the game. Three. Three. Play clock's running down. Hey. They're going back up top. Passes target. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. Early in this game, Phil, and already on the other side of the midfield strike. Nice job by the offense here. Good play calling too, Jim. Mixing up defense is off guard right now. Defense is taking advantage of it. Offense lines up here. First and ten. Handoff made. He's brought to a halt. This defensive front is so often disruptive and in the quarterback's face. Second down after... Going to the ground game, the first play. On the money. Game's 18. The 
slant route. It's a timing route where the wide receiver plants his outside foot at five to six yards and catches the football eight yards down the field as he's going across the middle. down here after the completion loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime this play call is for the fullback that's a gain of six what that run does it just puts the offense in a good situation so a good positive run that'll be second and four after the running play the Patriots go with the dime formation here on defense and the immediate handoff to the fullback in on the stop. Jim, the defense gives up a first down that time inside the red zone, but there's only so many things the offense can do. Let's see if they can hold them. First and goal. Brings it in for the score in the end zone. going down there and getting the first touchdown in this wild card game today. That'll ease the tension, give you a little confidence, get rid of those jitters. Shoot, maybe get some to the other team. The Dolphins lined up now for the point after. Extra point was good. to return the kick. No return here as he takes a knee in the end zone. And here's a quarterback coming onto the field who has plenty of experience under his belt. Yep, there's no doubt. He is the man in charge, and, and he shows it just the way he handles himself, uh, and that's why he plays so well. That's why he's in this game today. They come to the line of scrimmage, first down. The give out of the eye, brought down at the 26. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. the gun the defense gets a sack well your offensive line is not good enough just to stop the pass rush and you got to help them out how do you do that well you keep the tight end in let him be an extra blocker and you tell your running backs to help out too blocking some of these defensive linemen here we are in the playoffs, and when you compare it with the regular season, the microscope, it's out. The attention, it's there. It's all ratcheted up right now. Uh, it's a big difference, no doubt about it. You see more reporters in the locker room all during the week, and no matter how you play during the regular season, nobody cares. They're just worried about this playoff game. And he's going to be sacked. So just three plays and out for the offense. Well, that time the quarterback is sacked on the third down, and that's, of course, that's bad. But the good thing is he did not try to force the football down the field and get the turnover. The punter awaits the snap. Wants to give it a go here, and he's brought to the ground. Oh, 
They face first down. The Dolphins come out at a two tight end set. Running away from the pressure. He's got the catch. He's taken down at the 42. Nowadays, we see it all the time, don't we? Quarterbacks breaking contain, stepping up in the pocket, getting outside, and more and more we're seeing uh, these guys are getting better at throwing the football while on the run. Well, I think we've heard this expression about 7,000 times. It's a passing league, so we all know that. So you got to be able to throw the football and pick up some first downs. Offense lines up here. First down and 10. Last 12 on this play. The Dolphins offensive line is just whooping some tail today, aren't they? What a job up front. That helps the running back get in space, get down there, and pick up a big game. They'll run it here, and that picks up three. The Dolphins call the run play that time down in the red zone. It does not work, but when you're running the football, especially in the red zone, have some patience, stay with it, and if you do, most of the time you will get rewarded. Second down here. out of the pocket finds his mark it's hard to throw the football down the field once you get in the red zone that time the quarterback well he knows that and he looks down there nobody open deep throws it short and they get a nice solid pickup on that play call the defense comes out of the nickel three, 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 three. staying with the passing game on first down that ball has been picked off the tackle was made. You got to stay aggressive on the defensive side. That time the defense did. Even though the offense was going in to score, they finally they come up with the big play and they get the interception inside their own 20 yard line. It's first down as they head to the line. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. To the ground. That brings the play to an end. Here's a look at the offense. And if they're going to win today, this group of wide receivers must go vertical. They must open up the game for the offense. Coming up, second down. The Patriots come out. Two tight ends on the field. Play action. Looks to his left. Games 16. Hard to play man to man against such a quality receiver. You got to mix up the coverage. You play straight man to man, you're going to give up a lot of completions. First and ten. Keeps it here. Out to the left. And no one is going to catch this one as it goes out of bounds. As we get a look at the defensive starters, these linebackers will be counted on today to make plays in the running and passing games. Second down now. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. They'll go draw. They are in the backfield in a hurry and will bring him down for a loss behind the line of scrimmage. Now third and ten following the run. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. He's going to be tackled right around the 42-yard line. You just can't sit back there and play conservative defense in the NFL. The quarterbacks and receivers are too good. Third and over 10 yards, 
you play safe and you give up the first down. First down, following the long play. We'll run it. Here's the handoff. Hey, this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time they stopped that run just for a short game. One quarter complete, and we'll take a break as you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The NFL on EA Sports is brought to you by Head & Shoulders, the official shampoo of the NFL. That last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid oh being sacked for a third time. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. It's third down coming up. Split backfield here. They'll go shotgun here. Catch made. Got a big lane. Gains 19. When you talk about throwing the football into open space, that's almost always against zone defenses. That's what we saw that time. Good job of the quarterback throwing it in there. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Looking to go up top again on first down. That's a gain of eight. It's a nice drive by the offense, Jim. They're down. They're driving down the field. Let's see if they can put seven points on the board. After that grab, it's now second down and two. Mounting a serious drive. He'll stand back beyond the center in the gun. Secures it with two hands. Anytime you picked up a couple first downs, here's what happens. The defense starts to doubt what they're doing. But maybe more importantly, it gets those big boys over there tired. First down at the 21. On the money. He stacked up at that point. You can't play zone coverage against this quarterback. He knows it's zone, and he's going to find the open throwing lane, and he gets it done. Second down coming up. Play after play after play here on this drive. He'll throw it over the middle. That's a gain of seven. The Patriots offensive coordinator does a good job that time calling the pass down here in the red zone. Caught the defense off guard. They got to completion for a good game. This long drive continues. First and goal. Hand off. He's headed right. They bring him to the turf. Can the defense make a stop? The bent a lot here in this drive. They had the offense backed up. They let him march down the field. Now you're in the red zone. Make the right call and stop him. Second and goal from the five. Out of the eye. Here's the handoff. If I'm on the defense and the offense is this close to scoring, I'll tell you what I'm doing. I am sending everybody. I am going to gamble that it is a run. If they have the courage to throw it, run it. If they do, of course, it'll be a touchdown. Third and goal. Right back to him once more. He runs it across for the score. Touchdown. Well, that's really having deep belief in your offensive line. And then third and goal, your offensive line just road grades the defense out there and they get the touchdown running the football. The Patriots with a PAT to tie the contest. The point after try is in the books. The Dolphins are back deep, waiting to return the kick. And 
the fair catch is made. And a touchback. First down on the way. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. He's scrambling now. Brings it into his body. He's brought down right around the 43-yard line. That's a nice job that time by the quarterback. He's forced out of the pocket. And when he moves, he's excellent throwing the football on the run, and he gets the completion. First down here. Double tight end formation. Back to the air here on first down. Finds his mark. And they knock him down just a yard away from the first. We knew we might be in for some big numbers in the passing game today, and we've seen that so far, Phil. We have seen that. The quarterback has been magnificent, no doubt about it. And what you have to do on the defensive side, look, you know they're going to get the yards. You just hope to stop them down in the red zone and make them kick field goals. And he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. Kind of refreshing to watch, isn't it, to see a team that's has faith, the toughness, and the patience to just keep running the football, grinding out these first downs, resting their defense, and tiring out the opponent's defense. The play clock's running down. Has his man. You talk about controlling the flow of the game. Another first down, and the drive keeps on going. Yeah, why not? The defense, they're just sitting over there. They're taking the hits, and not even fighting back. It's a terrible job by the defense. This play set up by the long gainer. The give. Picks up eight here. The Dolphins have really been dominant today on the offensive side. In the red zone now, they just take the football and they run it right at the defense and pick up solid yards. Let's go. Second down and two. Takes another handoff. That'll stop the play right there. Good job that time by the offense. They pick up a first down inside the 20-yard line. Now we'll see if they can punch it in and get seven points. We've hit the two-minute warning here in the first half. Coming up at halftime, please stay tuned for the Verizon Halftime Report, presented by EA Sports. First half winding down as we return from the two-minute warning. They're able to move the chains after that last run. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. to go. Nice job of pass blocking, and the quarterback finds the open receiver for the touchdown. The Dolphins with the PAT to come. And the point after is good. The Patriots prepared to return the kick. Takes off from the five. He had nowhere to go, and they deck him at the 16-yard line. First down, offense readying for the snap. Offense lines up here. He'll take the snap from the gun. Ball's thrown incomplete. Great coverage there by the defense. Anytime your receiver runs any route in the NFL, they're worried about getting hit. Don't lead them too far in a slant route. Just throw it right at them. Offense lines up here. Out of the shotgun formation. Makes the catch. 
brought down after a gain of six. Third down. They're in the hurry up mode. Takes it from the gun. Shrugs off the first hit and off the mark on that short throw. On third downs, the defense knows in most situations it's going to be a pass, and let's give some credit to the defensive front. They pressure the QB, and they force the incompletion. Looking for a lane on the return. And he's going to be tackled right around the 31-yard line. They come to the line, and it's first down. They bring in the extra tight end. Makes the reception. That's a gain of only a yard. Arm strength is a nice thing to have when the window of opportunity is very small. Quarterbacks with strong arms can still fire it in there. Nice throw right on target by the QB. That pass play wasn't good for much. So now it's second down and nine. Nickel formation Let's here go. for the defense. Oh, it almost picked off that time. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that in my career where it should have been intercepted and the guy dropped it. You just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on that break? The wide receiver shifting around in motion. The Dolphins from the 32 pulls it in. The tackle's made and the first down is picked up. Sometimes they tell the receiver just to go long, run a fly route, run a nine route, because that means straight ahead or a streak. Show the speed that you have and get it done. The Dolphins have it at the 44. Keeps churning ahead, makes the reception. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. The Dolphins signal for the timeout. And that's the first one they've used. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Nickel formation for the defense here. Dragged to the ground. Looks like he's still about a yard short of the first. Quarterbacks love throwing the football on first down. Usually it's the easiest defense to throw against. They do a nice job that time. They get some good yards, and it's almost a first down. The reception, easy, wide open. When you throw this pass as a quarterback, you've got to stick it right onto the body of the wide receiver. They are nervous because they're running across the middle. First down here after the completion. That long game sets them up here on this play. The Dolphins call a timeout and are left now with only one. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. The Patriots lined up in the nickel. Here comes the wide receiver in motion. The Dolphins from the 22. And now he'll take off. Intercepted! He's got a little bit of daylight here. Steps out of bounds. Isn't it awesome on the defensive side where you have linebackers can make plays like that? Getting that interception, it's not always defensive backs that get to make those plays. Linebackers can do it too. First down coming up. Coming to the line. Hoping to avoid Let's being go. sacked for a third time. Screen. And this will just go for an incompletion. That second down coming up. Let's go. From the gun. 
for the deep ball. A takeaway. Nice tackle. Nice job of the defense that time. In position, they read the quarterback's eyes, and it led to an interception. First down here. Offense lines up here. They'll go ground. Gets about nine on the play. That does it here for the first half. Patriots trail with this one. We'll be back in a moment with the first half analysis. All right, welcome to the Verizon Halftime Report. I'm Larry Ridley. Let's take a look back now at the first half. The Dolphins know everything is on the line today, and they're staying close. The Patriots have controlled play to some extent, but this is clearly still anybody's game. So let's take a look at some of the highlights from the first half. Now to the middle of the first. The catch is made in double coverage, and he'd cap off the eight-play drive with a TD. The Dolphins with the early advantage. Dolphins take it at the six. Under pressure here, and the ball is picked off. Patriots defense gets off the field with the turnover. Offense now with the shot after the pit. He'll cut it out right on the outside run, and this run goes for a touchdown. We're brand new at seven. Dolphins line up at the eight. Pass into the end zone here, and after the short pass, he'll score. Dolphins is up now by seven. So that's all for us here at the EA Sports Studio. We'll get you back out to the field now for some more playoff action. And we're back now. Sun Life Stadium, the start of the third quarter. The Patriots prepared to return the kick. That'll be a touchback, and the ball will be placed at the 20. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. And here we go. The first half of the second half. Nothing there as this goes for a loss of two. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense. And now they have a good situation. This will be second down. An extra tight end on the field for this one. Here's the handoff and they'll run it. They knocked him down behind the line of scrimmage. Pass rushers, defensive players, they love situations like this, don't they? They got a little lead here. It's in the second half and it's third and long. You are expecting pass, so you can just let it go and try to get after the quarterback. Third down, following the run. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Going deep, very nearly intercepted. Well, you're down, here you are in the first half of the game. If it was fourth and short, I could see the coach trying to switch things around. If he, he might go for it, but we have fourth and long. Punt that football down there. Don't make a decision to put your team in a hole that they can't get out of. They face first down. Get ready. Three. The Dolphins get a first down. And 
now looking at some numbers here in the second half. It's more of the same for a guy who has been one of the best all year at the quarterback position. Now, what I like about him so much, he sees where he has to go with the football, and then he's able to deliver the football right on the money, no matter what the circumstances are. High down the field, drives it in between defenders. He is just a terrific thrower of the ball. That's what you want to do. Just get a first down, especially when you're on top. Keep the clock moving. Keep the defense guessing. Make them react instead of attack. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. The Dolphins now move the chains. Awesome. Every time you pick up a first down, what does that do? It shortens the game, also keeps your defense on the sideline, and they get the get rested up and ready for their turn. But you got a lead here. It's a small one in the second half. Keep getting those first downs. Now first and ten. And he's taken down. Well, I know this feeling. When a blitzer's coming, nobody's there to block him. There's nothing you can do as a quarterback, but try to protect yourself because you're going down. Second and long. Throwing now to his left. Game's 11. We've seen a quarterback today, Phil, who just can't be slowed down. Hard to slow down talent, and this QB is loaded with it, and he is showing it today, isn't he? Uh, you talk about any type of throw, off balance, off his back foot, on the run, and then when he needs to show that power, he lets it go, and he's been right on the mark. Touchdown, Miami! Never be satisfied in the NFL. Players are just too good. So when you get a chance to score, even though you're leading, take advantage of it. Awesome job by the coordinator on those play calls. Dolphins for the extra point. Add the extra point, the kick is good. The Patriots prepared to return the kick. And a touchback here will bring the ball out to the 20. The Patriots are ready to take over now, and their offense heads onto the field. Wide receivers are bunched up. First and 10 will go ground. An open lane. Tackles made. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. The defense comes out of the nickel. Here's the handle. Able to make the tackle about two yards shy of the first. Looking at this deficit, you wonder how much more they're going to try to run the football because it has not been there for the taking all game long. Yeah, the running game's been terrible. Hard to win a game in the NFL when you're one-dimensional. But if you want to win today's game, that's exactly what you're going to have to do. Throw the football. Gets it out for the completion. Well, when your team is behind, what do you do? Just come out there and get a first down. That's a nice job by the offense. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. It's a two-tight end formation. Gets the handle here. And they tap him down at the 37-yard line. I will say this for the offensive coordinator. He is persistent. They're not running the football very well today, and that time he tries to run game again. Gets a couple yards, but not much. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. The Patriots from the 37. They're going to get him here for a sack. 
There's nothing worse to a quarterback than having offensive linemen getting driven back in his way. That time, the right side of the line collapses, and it leads to a sack of the QB. Nickel formation here for the defense. The Patriots will take the snap from the 30. Too much pressure, and he's brought down again. We got to give that defensive front a lot of credit, man. They are pushing, they're getting after it. They know it's probably going to be a pass on third down, and they get back to the quarterback and take him down. They're in punting formation. This punt will be returned. Good piece of tackling. It's first down as they head to the line. Hand off made. And he's tackled at the 34-yard line. Nice job that time by the ball carrier. Getting it just past the first down mark. Big first down. Keep the chains moving. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Coming to the Let's line, go. hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Gains five. That was a power running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards. Nothing like it. Show the defense you're willing to get in there and slug it out and get some tough running yards. They want to keep feeding him the football. He's brought down at the 20-yard line. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they come up with a play that fools the defense. Offense lines up here. First down and 10. Gets it again. He's brought down. If you're running back and you want more carries, do things like this. Read the defense right, read the blocking, and pick up first downs. That's a really good job by the running back. No margin for error from just outside the goal line. That's a gain of eight. If you're a great player in this league, you're not going to have too many bad games in a row. And this quarterback has shown us today that he's back to being his normal self. That's right. He's just really too good of a quarterback to have back-to-back -back bad games. And what he did after last week, he looked at the film, he corrected the mistakes. That's why he's playing well today. Almost intercepted. One quarter to go, and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The Dolphins have the football as the fourth quarter gets started. Just a yard away. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. He'll take the snap. The touchdown, Miami Dolphins. It's pretty tight down in here. You got third and goal. Not a lot of room for receivers to work in, but the quarterback and receiver, they're on the same page. Good throw and catch. Dolphins for the extra point. Inside of the upright. The Patriots now have even more work to do to get back into this one. The scores 28 to 7. The Patriots prepared to return the kick. Fields the football at the three. And he's met head on right there at the 20. The Patriots come onto the field now for this next series. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. Catch made and gains about one. The Dolphins all season long have won the turnover battle, and today it's more of the same.
when you look at turnovers, it really, to me, comes down to one thing. That means you have a lot of speed on the defensive side. You can hit them before they are ready, and that's what they're doing here today. Second down and nine. He's looking to the right here on this throw. He's brought to a halt. The Patriots understand just get whatever yards you can every time you run a play. That's what they do that time. It's a short completion, but look what position it puts up here. In on third down, this is something they can handle. Has his target in on the stop. I think the best thing to say about that play, it's just a, it gained a few yards, so that's what you do. All plays don't score. Sometimes you just want to pick up a couple yards. The Patriots from the 32, setting up screen. He's got the catch. And they bring it down at the 38-yard line. Well, when you keep chipping away with these short throws, sooner or later, that defense is going to come up. And when they come up, that's when you throw it over the top. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback the field almost intercepted that time the defense did everything right in that situation they were in the right spot they were smart they read the quarterback's eyes but they dropped the pass the Patriots take it from the 38 fights through contact under fire on that throw well, quarterbacks know on third down, they got to make a decision to get rid of that football because the defense, they are coming after you. That time, just not good enough when he throws an incompletion. The defense comes out on the dime. The Patriots take it from the 38. Makes the grab and the feet are down. Well, he had all day long to throw the football that time. That's why he had success throwing the football down the field. I'll tell you what, this defense, they need to start blitzing this quarterback. Let's see how they back up the big play here. We'll send it back to the quarterback out of the gun. Great pass, great catch, great control. Nice job by the quarterback, finding the open guy short. They get the completion. They still do not get the first down, though. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. Throws the pass. Ball's picked off. And he's brought to the ground. Sometimes, as a quarterback, you just misjudge the talent on the other side. And what a play by the linebacker picking off the pass. What a pair of hands also. First and ten. They'll run it here. Brought down at the 44. First down here after the run. And he'll hand it off to the fullback. He is tackled right at the 50. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it, and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's gonna have all day to get it done. Second down and five. Gets about four yards that time. This is third down. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. I think the coach on the sidelines, he's going to be happy with every first down because he knows that's more time off the clock. When you're up like this, multiple scores in the second half, every first down just puts the odds in your favor of winning this game. Staying on the ground, and they tackle him there at the 34. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Feeds him again for a gain of about five. Nothing like seeing a complete offense. That's what we're watching here today. Yes, we know they can throw it, but what they're showing us here, they can grind out some first downs running the football, too. Games, well. The defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. They're able to move the chains after that last run. 
They come out in the dime package. Once again, a running play, and that's a gain of 10. Good job by the offense getting the first down in the red zone. Now it becomes tricky. Can you deceive the defense where you get a chance to get a score? Nickel formation for the defense here. Brings it in. The tackle is made. It's getting harder and harder in the NFL to score when you're this close to the goal line. So what will the offense do? They, they better be creative. That's all I know. Second and goal from the three. Looking across the middle, makes the grab. Touchdown. And what a touchdown there for the offense. The quarterback just fires that football in there. Look at the defenders around the receiver, but the receiver big enough, tough enough to go up in there and make that catch. The Dolphins line up now for the point after. It's good. The Patriots have been flat out manhandled so far. Perhaps their special teams unit can change the momentum of this one. They need something to go their way. The score is 35 to 7. And the tackle is made right around the 26 yard line. Two minutes to go before this one's in the books. Patriots now ready to take over as their offense heads onto the field. Now first and ten. He'll throw it over the middle. That tackle was made at the 27-yard line. That leads us to second down. They'll go right to the hurry up. Won't use a timeout here. Brings it in along the sideline. Well, you're really in a tough spot, but that is a good job picking up the first down. You're down big in the second half. All you can do, just keep picking up those first downs. You hope it leads you to a score, and then you play the game from there. First down here after the completion. The defense comes out in the nickel. The defense gets the sack. After that sack, drop them back nine yards. It sets up second down and 19. And he hauls it in. Jim, here in the fourth quarter, when you're down, what you want to do is just keep that football moving. That time it's a short throw, he gets a completion. Good job. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. The Patriots from the 37. And he's forced to the ground. The Patriots are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. And the Patriots are going to punt it. We'll see what he can do here. That brings the play to an end. The Dolphins ready now to start their next series. Take it here from the 22. Two tight ends on the field here. The Dolphins from the 22. Scrambling now. Just gets rid of it. Second down after the incompletion. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. And looking underneath, this will go incomplete. They face third down after the incomplete pass. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. The completion and he's tackled down after picking up the first. Tick, 
tick, tick, tick, tick. That's what we're trying to do. Make that clock keep running down. You got the offense out Let's there. Go. You got a big Let's lead in the second half. Every first down you get shortens that football game. And now on first down, they'll go back to the air. Makes the reception. They bring him down in the middle of the field at the 50. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. They're going back up top. Has his man. Gains 20. The Dolphins signal for a timeout. They have two remaining. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Here's the first snap after the big play. Staying with the passing game on first down. Throws the pass. Has 12 on this play. Offense going to stop the game here with a timeout. First down here after the completion. One more play, and it's in the books. Looking to go up top again on first down. The ball is jarred loose. He stacked up at that point. Well, it's all about timing. I got to tell you something. The safety did a wonderful job timing the snap count that time. Caught everybody off guard, and he gets the sack on the QB. First down on the way. Nickel formation here for the defense. Wants to go deep. And it falls incomplete. Excitement on one side, disappointment on the other. Only one team can move on to the divisional round. Well, you didn't get that first round by in the playoffs, but you get a first round win. You'll win a wild card game and now moving on to the divisional. Yeah, you're excited about it, Jim. You uh, win in a playoff game and you got that rhythm going. In other words, you played well during the regular season. You win a playoff game. You can't wait to get that division opponent in the divisional round. What a memorable game this truly was. For Phil Sims, Danielle Bellini, and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now, and we leave you with the GMC Never Say Never moment of the game.